Good morning, Jerry. Hey, good morning, man. Well, what uh, what are your thoughts as you hear the news? Well, it is, uh, <laughs> I just want to say that it is uh, uh, great to be on uh, uh, with you on the same day that the uh, uh, that the Fix releases their new album. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just out today, as a matter of fact. Yeah, uh, we we uh, certainly uh, here at the Cowboys have all their records and uh, their eight tracks and uh, and. Uh, Big announcement due to uh, uh, budget cuts uh, this year. They will be our uh, our Thanksgiving Day band this year. Man, that's great. Uh, yeah, so uh, uh, it ties in well because Radio Shack is our sponsor, <laughs> and, uh, and uh, they're gonna fix is gonna get out there and cause a lot of question marks over everyone's head. And so uh, Radio <laughs> Shack's uh, uh, slogan is "You've got questions, we got answers." So. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> So what can you tell us about your reaction to uh, well, Dez and his I trouble? I want to talk about uh, Dez and his troubles. Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm announcing uh, right here uh, on your airways mm-hmm. uh, that you have uh, that I am suspending Dez Bryant from the Dallas Cowboys. Whoa. Wow. wow. What, hold on a second. What's that, Stephen? What's that, Stephen? We got... Oh, what is this? Death chart. Uh, oh my God! I'm looking at our wide receiver depth chart here. Who is Salim Hakeem? <laughs> Salim Hakeem. I thought he played for the Houston Rockets. <laughs> uh, I have a new announcement to make. Yes. Okay. On your airwaves right now that you have, I am not suspending Des Bryant. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a quick about face. I'm uh, reversing course, and uh, Dez will not miss any games. And as you think about it, as you think about it, <laughs> that is as it should be. <laughs> that is as it should be, because I don't know that uh, suspending him will do any good. Uh, it seems to me uh, that keeping him on the field is the only way to keep him from having off-the-field problems. <laughs> so, <laughs> it's hard to argue that logic. <laughs> so I'm going to pioneer something here and suspend him from off the field activities. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. Well, you got to so be frustrated gonna, by all this yeah. though. It's just another incident. It is. It is. And uh when you have so many incidences as <laughs> like uh, Dez has had, uh, uh you do get uh, worried about it, but we're going to work hard to get him uh, the care uh that he needs to uh, uh to keep this stuff from happening. I'm going to get him a a jewelry consultant. Uh <laughs> And a sagging consultant to kind of uh, counselors to keep him from sagging and stealing jewelry all the time. So <laughs> I'll be stealing jewelry. <laughs> and, and I'm a bit worried because uh, Jerry Junior's been hanging out with Dez a whole bunch. Uh-oh. Uh oh. That's all I need is a is a uh, one of my uh, teenage boys uh, getting wayward with Dez like that. <laughs> teenage? Isn't he about forty? <laughs> uh, yes, but he acts like a teenager. <laughs> At least that's what Gene always says. <laughs> but I, I became uh, uh, this uh, kind of an interesting story. Mm-hmm. Uh, I became aware of the the Dez incident mm-hmm. on Saturday night when uh, Stephen called me on the on the red phone. I keep on my bedside table, <laughs> and uh, when it rang, I knew it was bad because uh, only two people have that number, and that's uh, Stephen and Ernest Borgnine. Oh. And, uh, <laughs> I haven't heard from Ernest in a few weeks. Yeah, hey, we have some bad news <laughs> yeah. there. What's that now? Uh, nothing. Oh, and uh, so that's how I found out about it was from the red phone on my bedside table. <laughs> hey, did you hear the good news? What's Let's the good news? Good news, shall we? Yeah. Did, did you see how much my organization's worth? Yes. Yeah, $1.85 billion or something? One point. Eight five billion, and I'm smiling when I say that. You better believe. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. With that kind of wealth, I'm going to get a whole new face made out of toddler skin. Oh my gosh, toddler skin! <laughs> did I say that out loud? <laughs> yeah, yes. I'm afraid you did. Poor toddler. And believe me, when they lower me into the subterranean crypt I have built up under that star, mm-hmm. people are going to say that I looked good. <laughs> <laughs> Well, good luck with Des, and uh, we hope that works out for you, whether you suspend him or not. 
I do appreciate it, Jody, and I thank George. you guys for, for handling this uh, story with the, uh, the sensitivity and the positivity <laughs> that it really needs. <laughs> Our pleasure. Yeah, you're welcome, Jerry. Okay, good morning. Hey. Morning to you. There he goes, Jerry from Valley Ranch.